Greetings everyone, welcome to another episode of Swag's Mini Piece Pack. I'm Swag, and welcome to today's episode. So in today's episode, I'm focusing on getting stuff that I need to, um, to make, um, get ready for the fight the dragon, because I want to fight the dragon in episode 30. So we're going to need potions, healing potions, which means we need glistening melons. So first thing we need to do is do awkward potions. Awkward potions requires nether wart. So we're going to look for two. So we'll make six. So we'll brew up some aqua potions there. We're also going to need two glistening melons, so we're going to need some gold nuggets, and we're going to need a couple melon slices. Do we have any melon slices up here in our food thing? I don't think we do. Nope, we didn't bring any over here. So we got to go all the way to our melon farm and get them. I'm also going to make warp stones and a warp thing. I want. I wonder if there's a void thingy. Nope, there's nothing to stop us from falling to the void. I must be thinking of a different mod that offers that. The void jar. Yeah. Whoa, look at all these melon slices. Excellent. So we need two glistening melons. So I got two of them out. Melons are an excellent early game food source, but not for late game, especially not in this mod pack. So if you grow them early game, I strongly suggest you do so. Okay, I need some gold. Nuggets, so... Glistening melons. I'm gonna make some planks. I'm gonna make books. I'm gonna make some bookshelves. Okay, now I can make because these are aqua potions. So to make potions of healing, we need to brew glistening melons. Gristing melon slices into aqua potions. There we go. Now we can go put these bookshelves down there. We're also going to need four emeralds, so. But I think now if I put something unenchanted in there. Yes, we have level 30 enchants now. We get level 30 in chance, even though we don't have level 30, we only have level 26. What's that? We have our healing potions. Excellent. We'll throw those in there. We'll need them when we go for our final battle. We'll have to enchant the bow eventually. But we're not yet ready to do so. Right. Let's go get the emeralds that we need and then we can make the warp stones. So I want three warp stones. And one war I mean four warp stones and three waste stones. I want one waste stone for here, one their waste stone for where we find the um the end portal, which is the stronghold at the uh, reported by the end portal. In the end portal, and a final one in the end dimension itself. I must eventually put one in the nether. So I think we'll sell some potatoes to our farmer, former farmer's friends.
then we'll sell some beetroots. And have a couple of them left over. And he's now upgrade. And like we can get like we can sell melons here for emeralds now too. Or here we we could we could have sell some some of melon blocks. Spare emeralds is always a good thing. And we're gonna to have to do more trades to get the some more enchanted books, of course. We're also gonna to have to make a new anvil. But let's first make our dyes. We do like that, then we combine them to purple dye. So we we're going to make four warp stones. There we go. Now I can make three waystones. go. I'm going to place the emeralds in there. Next time I'm going to work on getting armor and a sword and as well as a chang or bow. I'm also going to try and get levels between episodes. And I'm going to put away the plant extra planks because we don't need them. Like, cause obviously, golden this chest plate and boots will not work for our dragon fight, which I'm planning to make. Episode thirty will be the dragon fight. Episode twenty nine will be us hunting down the end, of the uh, um, stronghold. So maybe we can travel to episode to the end dimension in episode thirty. But this right here is where we're going to. But this will be right here. Put right here, I think. Love farm. Done. So the farm is what will bring us here. Whoa, did I put one of the, one of those? Well, I'll set one in Crossimer. So I'll need... Did I put one up there? I might have put one up there. Oh, I got two of them. Good. Okay, so, yeah. So, I'm going to need to get some diamonds for armor. I want to see if I can get a netherite. Let's see if we can get nether block of netherite from our market. And if so, how much will it cost us? There we go. Block of netherite will cost four blocks of emeralds. So, it's with, with trades, it's possible. I'll see if I can get some golden apples. That'll be even better. I've got a ton of rotten flesh, so I might get some emeralds. Do that guy. Let's head over to our thing and see if we got if we got any rotten flesh there to do or do do some training with. We got time this episode. I've only been a lot been recording this one for about eight minutes oh yeah we got a stack take that up too hmm grab a stack of those grab the redstone uh, blow up the glowstone I could, in theory, like, combine the armor and, like, then melt it down for gold. But it's, like, very poor recovery. It's, like, not worth the effort, almost.
We got three stacks of, of that to work with. Excellent. We can work with this for training. Let's go see. Also, we got plenty more villagers, so if we set up, set up more trains, we'll be able to get more damn emeralds, because that way we don't have to get enough diamonds. But diamonds aren't cheap, I don't think. No, diamonds are 16 emeralds a piece, so it's better to go mine for them. See if there's anything else we can sell. We can sell some of the string here. See anything else? Wait. Flint sticks. Uh, paper. Oh, we got diamond stuff here. Fish C2. Fish C2. Fortune 1. Fish C2. Fish C2. Not for him really. Rabbit stew. Hmm. I could buy a rabbit stew from this guy. Or two of them. Oh, we got three rabbit stews. Loom. Well, we don't have enough wool to trade with him yet. Leather. Hmm. Don't have any leather even that much. An emerald for six. Two arrows for a bow. Mm -hmm. Our trades are pretty decent, but yeah, nothing I'm really fanatical about right now. So I'm gonna do, so I think that's where we're so yeah I gotta go mining for diamonds if I want to make diamond armor but I'll do that between episodes like I've got a lot of work to do now I guess I'll use the sugar for oh I got four apples so I can so I can do some of the trades and maybe do some more of that, of that. so I might do that Okay, so string will go there. Could trade some of this letter and work work up our, our guy there. Okay, so I think Flint goes in there. Let's see here. Throw the glowstone in there. Redstone in here. The rotten flesh can go in there. Ender pearls go in there. And that's okay. We're gonna need for four golden apples. We're gonna need thirty-two gold. We're good. I'm gonna have to process eight of sixteen of this. That should give us thirty-two. So and then. least 32 gold now give me at least 32 gold or well, I could just melt that up too
Okay, so I'm gonna need some. Okay, so for, I'm gonna need to make two fermented spider eyes. I need six bottles of water then to do this. I'm going to need two sugar. Throw that up there. I'll throw the apples in there for the time being while the while that processes. I'll go get the water and then I'll go up and get the spider eyes. So I can make two fermented spider eyes. For two potions of weakness. There we go. Okay, so there's our potions of weakness. Excellent. There we go, now we got seven posts of weakness. Excellent. That's very good news, folks. Now, let's see here. Ooh, we got 48, so we're gonna need two more coal. Then we're gonna have to wait for the gold. We're gonna have to wait for two more apples, of course, but But folks, I'll do that off camera. I'll like I'll work on my villager stuff. I'll work on mining diamonds. Basically, I'll do everything I need to do. So the next time I can make a full suit of nether netherite armor. So I'll I'll get the four blocks of four blocks of emerald that I need. Also get all the diamonds I need to make a full suit of diamonds so I can upgrade to netherite. And of course we also need to get the diamonds for a diamond sword. So we next time we can make a full get re, get ready for for fighting the dragon in episode tw twenty nine. Like I said, next episode we'll get the our armor and our weapons done. Tw episode twenty nine, which will be next Wednesday, will be us fighting the stronghold. And episode 30, which will be next week, Friday, we I will be fighting the dragon. Win or lose, you will see it in a video. So hopefully, so I'll look forward to, to seeing you guys either um, tomorrow for the August Dream of Fun, which will start at noon, Alberta, Edmonton time, which is UTC minus 6. Um, six hours behind Greenwich time or um, so that says so, so whatever so whatever our time so so figure out what your time is behind Greenwich and then see how it compares to mine and then adjust the time as necessary I'll be live at least for six hours but if I get support well you can find out how just use the command stream of fun tomorrow on what well, if if you come watch me on Twitch, and you can find out how to support me, although supporting me on Buy Me a Coffee is definitely definitely one of the ways of being able to to cause me to stream longer tomorrow. Just use the um. That'll be of course if you want to support me for for creating these awesome videos. Or buy Me a Coffee is an excellent way of doing so. And of course, on um, Buy Me a Coffee from. At the end of this, on, for after episode 30, there will be a world download 
for the after the final episode of this of this series, which will be me facing the Ender Dragon, available to my members on Buy Me a Coffee. So be sure, be sure to choose to support me if you wish to get that world download, folks. But until next time, folks, my name's Nathan, aka Swagnell Ice, and I'll see you either live on Twitch tomorrow or next time on the next episode of Swag's Mini Peaceful Pack, which is a modern Minecraft series. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share as it helps 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 the channel out. Until next time, goodbye!